Do days grow long and tiresome? I think perhaps they do. As a child, I definitely had a great fascination with dragons, their power and ferocity was unrivaled by any imaginary creature. There was nothing that could properly oppose them. No. Well, there was one thing. Knights. Knights could oppose them. Using their power of the lands. They were able to end the lives of dragons. Now you may say, of course you're wrong. There were no dragons in the medieval period. And to that I say, well, that's a boring answer. Can you picture if these narratives of dragons were really accurate. Knights really did ride out to face them. They really did die. Some of them, perhaps, had their faces marred. by the flames. One might ask the question, once made hideous, would a knight have a chance of finding someone who would want him? Or, thus marred, would he be hideous and abhorrent? People often say that beauty is in the eye of the beholder. But how many recoil from badly mutilated people? 
This is far from the health and signs of strength and life that most would find attractive. One could picture a knight who sought glory, and perhaps the favor of the maidens, but instead only gained complete shunning, perhaps they would turn away in pity, but still, how many women want a man? With a hideous face, I would suggest not many. Courage often has its price, and many die entirely unsung as heroes. And many are sung but after their death. How many people died alone? But had many flowers put on their graves. Some people do not much care if they lose their lives, because they say we all die anyway. They merely want the life they live to be an interesting one. But one must ask if there is a life beyond this one, Would that change the way you live, or suppose that you know tomorrow was your last day? If your life was going to come to an end, what would you do? Perhaps you would take more risks if there was a dragon to slay and you would know and you knew you would die tomorrow what's the harm in risking death the pain would perhaps be feared but not the death <laughs>